good evening, and welcome to painting and all. Here's your canvas, darling. Thank you. Here's your canvas, please. I think you'd be very careful with it. It's very fragile. Today we will be painting a Bob Ross theme. Paint whatever you actually want, you know. And just, you know, do what you want. You know, blank canvas. Wait, did we get the right thing? We probably got the wrong shit, huh? You know, this is acrylic paint. And I should be painting as well. Hey, I'm a pretty good painter, I think. Alright, everybody, we're gonna be painting some paints and paints and stuff. It's gonna be real fun, like. And I suggest start with the lightest color and work your way to the darkest. So start with yellow, put it here, and then go from there. Okay. Christ. And then you're gonna want some yellow, right? Yeah. Well, let's just do this right now. Is this a circular brush? Hmm, interesting. We are the painters of the century. I am making donkey. So what do you got, James? I am making a rainbow. I have, so far, not much, but it just takes a little bit of time, some time. But you'll see, it'll be really cool. Oh, I got donkey going good. Definition, but it's definitely long. We're not finished yet. In the meantime, here's a progress. I know you're not watching me paint it much, but there is what I've got so far. <laughs> Can you help me? No. I have an idea of what I want to do here, so yeah. I'm just gonna take a second. Yeah. Obviously, I need to let it dry a little bit, but I think we're getting there. What do you got, James? Mm. I have a detailed painting now. So nice. uh, it's the rainbow with the yellow brick road and the path that leads to wherever you are. Nice. Oh, it looks very, very colorful, Johnny. I like it very much. Very nice. Kind of messed up on that. I'm gonna let it dry and then I'll fix it. But it's kind of what we got going on so far. Why my donkey looks so magnificent? Magnifico, magnifico. Hey guys, my name is John uh, Corbin. I created this art piece here in the course of just today, as you can see here. It's a cat demon theme, uh, made out of some paints we picked up at the store, nonetheless. And tell us what your inspiration was for this piece. Donkey. 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 What's that on the tree there? Owl. And what's that down below? Cat. And, um, tree. Okay. Hi, I'm the artisan, and I just created this painting today. It took me a few minutes. I was watching Bob Ross on the television and getting inspiration and hearing some music and came up with a rainbow and a theme as well as the... What do you call your piece? I call it Cock and Balls Goes Rainbow. I show it to us like this. Okay, so... Um, let me take it. So what's the gold part in the center? It's called the Yellow Brick Road. It comes from the Wizard of Oz. And, and it's, uh, it's kind of a joke about life and going into the rainbow, we're all wanting happiness. And in this piece, the uh, male phallus is definitely featured, as well as the amazing, amazing balls that are so fulsome. And <laughs> Are you fondling the balls? What's wrong with you, man? Oh, they just feel so... Is the art just that great? It's amazing. Oh, and art is just fantastic. Hello. How are you? So this piece is inspired by the shadow within all of us. So as you can see, 
I have a very bleak setting. And yet, even though the, star, the sky is dark, you have the light, and then the shadowy figure here. What is the name of your piece? My piece is the shadow within us all. Mm. It's the tree of life, the shadow worshiping the tree, which, it. even though it looks like a full-grown tree, the shadow is huge and is about the same size. And then you've got the ocean, which represents the thought of all people, because water has memory. Nice, wonderful. I really like what you do with the textured ground over there. It really shows like there's a level of depth in your picture in multiple levels. It's really good. Well, thank you. Bravo, bravo.